Here I've got Huawei MatePad Pro and I'm gonna show you the top tricks of the camera. So at first we have to click on the camera button here. And now we are in the standard photo mode. So let's look at all of these settings around. And uh, let's focus on this settings bar here. So here we can uh, change the modes of this camera. As you can see, beauty mode, photo mode, video mode. And when we tap on more, we get access to more advanced modes here. And we can pick from this, as a, for example, from, from the Pro mode or moving picture. And the good thing of this camera is when we tap on this icon with I letter, we get access to the information about all of these modes. So we can read from uh, that and uh, learn what all of these modes uh, do. Uh, so I'm going to stay for now on the standard photo mode. And let's see what's here. And the first one I'm going to show is this uh, button here. So here we can uh, get access to the zoom. As you can see, this is how it works. We can also zoom by using two fingers like that and get closer and also go back. The next one here is the exposure compensation. So when we tap on the screen like that, we also focus uh, by using the square and we get access to this sun icon and when we tap this a little bit longer we can uh, change the exposure and make our picture more uh, bright and more dark as we need this is how it works and now let's focus on the, a few settings of this uh, the first one here is uh, are the filters so by tapping on this we can easily turn on the filter and we get the slider so we can pick a uh, one of this and make our picture just more beautiful before we take it so for now i'm going to stay on the original one so known and let's go to the next button here this is the flash so here we can turn on the auto flash turn on the flash uh, every time we take a picture also here we have access to the flash always on and we can turn it off like that and now let's go to the settings here by tapping on this uh, we get access to the more advanced settings and uh, we can pick from the general settings and the capture settings and we start with the resolution uh, so here we can change the quality of our picture and also the resolution this is connected here and we can pick from 4 and 3 and with 13 megapixels this is recommended and this is what it looks like and also from a one and one with 10 megapixels. This is how it looks like. And the third option is the full screen uh, resolution with 11 megapixels. So this is how it looks like. I'm going to stay on the recommended one for now. And now let's go to the next line here. This is, these are the location tags. So here we can uh, turn on this button to save the location of our picture and also turn it off like that. Uh, the important thing is to make it work. Even if it's turned it on, we have to be connected with the internet, for example, with the Wi-Fi, and we have to turn it on the location of this device here. So I'm going to take a picture to show you how it looks like and we go to the preview here and now we have to slide up uh, to get access to the location info this is how it looks like so greetings from Krakow and we go back to these settings here and let's move to the capture settings the first one are the assistive grid so by tapping on this we can turn on and turn off the grid lines and this is how it looks like. So it generates us these lines. This is helpful, for example, when we want to use the rule of third in photography and helps to improve our photographic skills and in composition. And we can also turn it off like that uh, by using this button again. And here also we can turn on and turn off the camera sound by using this button like that. And now let's go to the camera timer. So here we can change the delay of taking picture. As you can see, we can pick from two seconds, five seconds and 10 seconds. I'm going to pick two seconds to show you how it works. And let's take a picture. And as you can see, the picture was taken with two seconds delay. 
I'm going to turn it off now and let's go to the audio control so here we can by using this button turn on and turn off the audio control of this device so when we keep turning it on uh, we can make our take our picture by saying just one word for example say cheese to take photos and we have can pick from speak loudly to take photos so i'm going to stay on say cheese to take photos and let's try to take a picture cheese and as you can see the picture was taken with just one word without touching the screen and after turn it on all of these settings we may want to go back to the original settings so we can do it by just restore the faults here and ok so that's all thanks for watching subscribe our channel and leave the thumbs up